If you're new to my work, my name is Vanessa Simpkins. I run a seven-figure women's empowerment slash coaching consulting training company where we help women all over the world every single day create their first $3,000, $5,000 coaching program and sell it online in our eight-week bootcamp. Uh, And today, I'm so excited to share this content with you because throughout the last 10 years of teaching coaches, this is the number one thing they struggle with, whether they're a brand new coach, whether they're a seasoned coach. So this is for you. If you are already a coach, if you're thinking of becoming one, maybe you're a healer, a speaker, an author, maybe you've already been in the game for five or 10 years or two years. Maybe you're still in the process of getting your coaching certification. This is for you. You're going to love today's free content. And the problem that we see is You know, some coaches are like, well, I don't know who my ideal clients are. I don't know if I'm targeting the right people. I don't know if my messages are landing. And if you don't get this right, guys, you don't have a business. This can stop you dead in your tracks. And I've seen people in the industry for a few years still come to me and say, Vanessa, I don't know if if I'm even if my message lands. I don't know if, you know, what story do I use? So there's a lot of confusion here and this shows up in your business like procrastination or when you want to pull the trigger and, you know, create a website or a funnel or something and you don't know what to do. What, what do I call my program? Are my, are my program names engaging? Am I selling the right thing? We're going to get that clear for you guys today. First point I want to share with you is your authentic story, guys. I don't care how many certifications you've taken. Nobody is buying your certifications. In my world, we teach women how to lead with their authentic selling story. What do you mean, Vanessa? Well, it's it's the, the story of the, the moment in time when you made a decision to change your life forever. And we help you zoom in on that story and tell that story to your audience. Now, the reason we start with this authentic selling story is because You don't want to be going out there trying to reach people or teach people or sell to people that you have no business doing, that you have no business teaching. You want to start where you're at and you want to serve from where you're at. You don't have to be Tony Robbins. You don't have to, you don't have to have 12,000 certifications, but you need to be in your own lane. And an authentic selling story is going to allow your potential clients to see and hear and feel and think and know that, okay, she's been to the burning bush. She understands where I'm at. And then and only then is your audience even open to listening and seeing you and listening to your marketing messages and seeing you as an expert. Do you get that? It's important. So what is your journey? What is your life experience taught you? I don't care. I mean, I don't care if you've got a certification. Nobody really cares about that, right? Let's say you were to go to Bosnia and you've got your arm blown up and you're like bleeding to death. Who do you want to sew you up? Somebody who's just got their doctor certification and hasn't worked on anyone? Or do you want to, you want the guy that's been in the trenches in Bosnia sewing people up for 20 years? I bet you take the guy who's been doing it for 20 years. So that's why the most important thing that you need to get clear on first is your authentic story. And it's the story of when you went out there in the world, something wasn't working, you decided to, the Joseph Campbell's hero journey story, right? You go out to try something new, you find a new way, you crash and you burn, and then you figure it out, and then you come back to the tribe, and now you're dedicating the rest of your professional career to helping XYZ people get XYZ results. That's the story that we wanna get you clear on, and that story is more important, sharing that, languaging that, being vulnerable enough to share that is more important than your, than your coaching certifications.